Hello everybody. Okay, so today I have made John Conway's Game of Life in Minecraft. As you can see right here, um, it's definitely doing stuff. For those of you who don't know what um, John Conway's Game of Life is, it's basically a cellular automata, which means it's a grid of squares that can either be on or off. And they change depending on their neighbors. Okay, if it has two or three neighbors, then and it's on, it stays on. And so, for example, this would this pixel would stay on. If it has only one neighbor, or more than three, like say this in the number, then it will turn off. And a cell that's off will turn on only if it has exactly three neighbors, so this one will turn on. This is a flying machine, or a glider. It's basically just repeatedly, it basically just moves like this. This is what's called an oscillator. It basically just, it's basically just an infinitely repeating structure. It pretty much does nothing. These are stable shapes. They basically um, do absolutely nothing. As you can see, it's on, but nothing's happening. There is one other structure in John Conroy's Game of Life. It's um, basically completely random, but and usually lasts a long time. Like for example, I'll show you this one. It basically acts like a bomb. Okay, yeah, and another thing about this is that I kind of made it so it can kill things. For example, if I were to make a little glider, like this, and then just so shove chicken right here. You will see that they get killed if they come into the path of the flying machine. So this also works with items and players. So, for example, if I were to throw that in the path, it kind of is gone. You can give it anything, and it destroys it. And I also said that it works on players. And there's a lot of command blocks. Well, that's about it. Uh, I'll put the world download in the description if you want to try it out yourself. Bye.